Hey guys, it's been a while since I made a video. Thought I'd uh, share this uh, one here with you. My uh, surface grinder, I needed a, a nozzle holder for my uh, cool mist system and uh, decided to uh, try a few things and uh, fabricate uh, one up for myself. I thought you might like a, to know a, a little bit of the uh, math that I needed to use to uh, calculate the depth to uh, grind on the uh, spherical uh, part here so there would be a flat on there. This is the uh, piece that uh, holds the nozzle and uh, swivels inside the, uh, the uh, nut. Using a, a little math here, mainly the Pythagorean theorem, I was able to uh, figure out that the uh, H2, which is how much down feed I'll need after touching off the top, um, that it's going to need to go down about uh, 33 and a half thousandths in order to give me a uh, eighth inch uh, diameter flat on the uh, half inch uh, diameter piece. As you can see, the uh, the brass that I was using uh, doesn't uh, spark very much, or if at all, when uh, done on the uh, surface grinder. So there should be the flat, and I'll uh, get the radius gauge and uh, kind of show you how it turned out. That looks pretty good there. It might just be a little bit big. This part I'm uh, fast forwarding through is just uh, finding the uh, center on the ball. Then I'll uh, go ahead and uh, center drill, um, drill, and then uh, tap it for the uh, quarter 20 thread. And you can see the uh, the final part of the ball here. This part here, I'm just uh, facing off. Then I'm going to turn down the uh, the outer diameter here to the uh, size that I'm going to uh, need for the uh, for the neural. And then uh, go ahead and center drill here, and then drill out the uh, main part with the uh, drill. And that's a half inch uh, for a uh, 5 8 18 thread. And then here I'm using a half inch uh, radius uh, ball and drill to actually put a ball on the side of the inside. I ended up uh, not putting it uh, deep enough, which if I make a, uh, another nut here, I'll actually go a little bit deeper to see if I can get a little better grip on the ball. And then after this, I'm uh, drilling a little bit for the through hole that needs to uh, to go into the other end. I happen to have a 5 8 18 thread, so that's what size I uh, decided to go with uh, for this project. Since I could turn an 18 uh, thread pitch on the uh, on the male part of the thread. Go ahead and put the uh, neurals on it. Uh, I uh, haven't uh, done a whole lot of knurling, so I'm getting used to the tool and then also uh, getting the, the proper depth. I probably went a little bit too deep and just uh, left the uh, neurals a little bit sharper than they uh, probably needed to be.
Here I uh, turned around the uh, piece and I'm actually uh, just starting to face off the, uh, the uh, part to expose the, uh, the, the inner hole and make it uh, as deep as I uh, wanted. The banging that you're hearing is a, uh, a link belt that I have in the, uh, the metal studs on it to get the cover on the lathe if I don't have the uh, cover on right. Just uh, turning this down to uh, for the 5 8 18 thread and then uh, at the end here I'm also going to uh, add in a little thread relief and uh, then start the uh, threading. Here I am using the half inch ball end mill to uh, put the uh, cup inside the uh, main body of the, uh, the nozzle holder. I'm trying to go just uh, far enough where I can get some good ball contact but I can't go beyond the, uh, the diameter of the uh, of the end mill, otherwise the ball would just completely uh, see inside. This is where I found that I hadn't uh, 
went in deep enough on the uh, on the nut side and it wasn't getting very good holding power so I did go back in and uh, deepen that a little bit just a little slow-mo here I just showing you the uh, cupped in and uh, where the uh, ball for the nozzle holder fit This piece here, you can see me, I'm just uh, testing it out here a little. I uh, will have to go back in and uh, either remake the, uh, the nozzle holder piece or uh, drill it a little bit larger. I hadn't uh, measured correctly and the uh, nozzle wasn't uh, completely going through. Thanks for watching. Hopefully uh, you at least got a little bit uh, out of the video. Talk to you guys later.